Howdy everyone, 7.38 in the morning, negative 13, real feel at negative 21. Got ourselves some green bean, potato, and chicken. Here we got cauliflower, egg, and cheese. Thirty six degrees and sunny early February. It's just amazing how fast the snow melts when it's like thirty degrees and sunny. I was just at the gas station, I seen a lady struggling with a van sliding door trying to get a wheelchair ramp out for this other lady in a wheelchair and so after watching them for, you know, about thirty seconds I could tell they needed help, so I went over there and well, we got the ramp out so the lady could get in the car again and then got them all situated and they pulled out of the parking lot ahead of me. Look at that. We got, we got puddles. We got puddles. We got sun reflecting off the water. Look at all this water. Beautiful gas station that looks like a log cabin. Um... In the Wisconsin Dells, there's a log cabin McDonald's, and it actually just won the most uh, pretty McDonald's in the country, maybe the world. I'm not really sure. I didn't read the article that well, but uh, yeah, you know, I mean, log cabins are cool. These two uh, abandoned buildings, I think, would be cool to turn into, like, you know, Red Oak Shop, because it's centrally located where I live and I could get anywhere I gotta go in like eight miles basically and then uh, Blaine's is right up the road here small engine repair and stuff like that so yeah I don't know I think it'd be cool one day but obviously I am so far from that what up not even wearing my coat got my raincoat on like my little windbreaker So we're leaving Blaine's. I got this nice flannel in there. Um, it was on sale from 40 for 20 so 50% off, so I just went ahead and snagged it. Also, tax write-off, because uh, I need something nice and presentable to wear while I go meet new clients. So, hey, two birds, one stone, right? Doesn't feel like winter anymore, 42. Uh, Walmart's probably got all their summer stuff locked in those like they typically do, and then uh, they'll get their summer side ready here. Got the wife some flowers for Valentine's Day. Just took two bouquets and made them one. Thirty-nine degrees, mid-February. Tomorrow's Valentine's Day, and uh, we are running out of snow in the medians. We still got plenty over there, but it'll be gone soon. They are tired of the snow in the parking lot. They are hauling it out of there. That's our movie theater on uh, one of them. Well, there's the suburban. She going to get fixed. I think it's the rear U joint, but I'm not really sure. So I'm just dropping it off to these guys. They're going to look at it, let me know what it is, tell me the price. I'll tell them that's cool with me because I need it. And, uh, yeah, we'll get it back and be whipping around town in no time. I forgot. I was just so excited to go drop the Suburban off at the mechanic that uh, I didn't really think about how I was going to get home. So that's how I'm getting home. <laughs> just walking. Look at that. Snow's melting. Good morning, son. Happy Valentine's Day, dude. All right, we're getting it back from the shop here, about to drive it home. I guess it wasn't the U-joint. I guess it was like a distributor cap, and they uh, had to put a new one on. So $446 later, he just said, let me know if it gives you any grief. And uh, my son, you can hear, he's excited to have it back as well. So, yeah, all right, well, let's test drive it and see if it gives us any grief, huh? Well, we made it home. I didn't see any new issues, and uh, I don't know. 
definitely, definitely driving 100% better than it was when it went into the shop. So uh, I'm happy. Call it a win. In the suburban, uh, just wanted to give it a longer drive, and uh, it is doing pretty good. I'm happy. I feel like it is almost running better than when I purchased it. So can't can't complain. The dog randomly barked, so you know I had to make sure everything was okay. 1 a.m. But uh, it's been raining for all day, all afternoon, all night, and like right now it's raining uh, pretty good. I'd, I'd say if it was snow, it'd definitely be over eight inches of wet. So kind of, kind of lame. We're not getting it. I got the suburban back. I'm ready for it. So hopefully we still get a a few more yet this year. There's a lot of limbs down in this guy's yard, in his neighbor's yard, so I just dropped off a, a business card to them. Now I gotta, I'm gonna drop one off at this house because they have a bunch right there too. So their driveway is like perfect, but this right here, I'm gonna scoop this out into the road, get rid of the ice, and then throw some salt in front of their mailbox, and we will, uh, we'll call it good here. So, actually, we decided to skip all that jazz for now, and then I just kind of dug them out a path to the back of the mailbox, and you can get it from there. All right, well, let's roll out of here. Yo, don't clown on me too much, but uh, I can't be the only one that buckles their food in for safety. A few days after Valentine's Day, and uh, it's a little cold again. The walleye is back at Culver's. Also... They're hiring, starting out at like $18 an hour now. That is a wild. But I've been craving Chipotle for days, and the cravings won today. Well, I guess I can't be too mad that it's only 21 degrees at 1 o'clock in the afternoon. Uh, we got four chances for snow next week, so uh, hopefully this like little random February video ends with me heading out to go do snow and then I'll have a, a few videos of snow removal but uh yeah I don't know I guess we'll uh, find out in a few days chopping up some more ice and uh, as you can tell tis not the the thinnest ice in the world looks like someone busted a giant car window Hasn't even been that many days, but uh, all those, they must have got them all unloaded and shipped on out of here. I bet you it's all inside. We're at the Walmart. Yo, that was crazy. So, I'm in Walmart, obviously, and all of our phones just started going off at the same time for a service alert. Uh, this guy's living in his van. I seen him holding a cat. The cat was pretty cute. Cardboard sign in the windshield that says, uh, need money for food and gas to eat and stay warm. And, uh, you know, it's been a slow month for me. Probably shouldn't. But at the same time, I'm just going to, I'm just going to give them $10. So it is what it is. We'll worry about making that 10 bucks back later. Just leaving Walmart. Um, snow's still coming down a little bit. I wanted to get one of these, uh, hitch locks so this one has a sleeve on it for 5 8 inch um there's a hat so hopefully that comes off and then just the half inch is there because that's what i need so yeah i'd like to thank you guys for rocking with me during this slow february video i'm sure i'd have no idea how long it's been i'll try to edit it down to not being forever long it's the day after i was doing a little bit of light shoveling for that random snow we got overnight uh, I fixed my snowblower this morning, but the lady had called me for one-time service. Her guy never showed up, so I just ran over there and did her driveway, sidewalk, and front path. I also peeked around at a couple other clients' properties, and they are looking awesome in the sun, so I'm good. Let's get on with the outro. All right, well, thank you guys for watching. Cheers to more bids and vids. Have a great day.